This country has three parts, on one part of the land. How modern. It is a consequence of the last war they had. They were divided into the Republic of Srpska. Federation of Bosnia and Herzegovina. And Birchko District. And they call this division, the Dayton Accords. Or a peace agreement. We don't know how yet. But. Someone came up with the idea to leave the country that was separating from Yugoslavia, as a peace agreement, divided into three parts. How ridiculous. And guess what's next? This state has three presidents. Wait. How did they manage to have three presidents? Something went wrong here. Let me explain. Bosnia and Herzegovina is an extremely beautiful country. Beautiful rivers, mountains, culture, buildings, etc. And they have three problems. The first is bad politics. The other is irresponsible people. And the third is that these two are connected. Yes. This guy here, is a member of the presidency. Drunk like everyone else. And this guy behind, he may have figured out where he lives. Maybe, we will check. When I say they have a problem with politics, believe me, this is an art like nowhere else. For example, this guy is the Prime Minister of the Federation. Some thought this was a fashion attempt with this jacket, but trust me this is just an attempt to do something alone. Or this guy. He was the Minister of Security. And he ordered stricter measures for crime. A few days later, he was arrested. Well, someone didn't explain to him how security works. Here, this beauty, goes to the store, for private purposes with an official car. And accompanied by a police patrol. I don't see what the problem is. The average salary of politicians is five times higher than the average salary of citizens. Because the country is multi-ethnic, every nation has its own president, ministry and so on. And they are well paid to do nothing. Because they just can't make decisions easily. It takes the consent of all these presidents, a multi-ethnic parliament, this guy from a little while ago. And things just get complicated. Don't worry, the picture is random, these guys don't fight. I'll explain later. The inhabitants of Bosnia and Herzegovina are multi-ethnic, Serbs, Croats, Bosniaks and others. And they get along very well. But the problem is that they are politically oriented towards their nationalities. There are those who are, simply Bosnians. Aren't they? You know what I mean. But most of these people are very hardworking, and educated. It's just that their success goes somewhere else. They are everywhere in Europe. Almost the most populated foreign states. But. Bosnians love what they love. Bullfighting. Folk music. And local food. They have nice advantages, but their disadvantages are irresponsibility. Or what is excessive freedom in this case. Such a mess does not exist in any country. Of course there are worse situations, but this one is special. Nobody wants to solve the problem here. The thing is simple. Politicians do what they want, in return people do what they want. Bribery is almost a public thing. Why don't they vote for a new government? They won't. And even if he wants to, I said a little while ago, bribery is a public thing. When things go wrong for politicians. They challenge simply a fake war. Simply one of them mentions the secession of the entities. And others mention war. Then the first says I will attack you first and the second says you will not. Oh yes I will. Oh no you won't. Oh yes I will. Until they win the election, because every nation elects its president. And after all, people in Bosnia need to know one thing. You love your country, and the people around you. But don't trust anyone. Bye.